David Sales.
Not one in not in not one conversation that you guys have had here today has had anything to do with safety. Absolutely nothing. Except for the police officer, the sheriff from Clackamas County stating what a detriment expanding those lines are going to be to his force and to the public. You want to upgrade the rail system? What about the buses that are expired? What about your equipment there? What about your preventative maintenance towards that? Preventative maintenance towards safety, the number one concern of the public and the city of Portland. I've had so many comments brought up to me since this incident has happened. How are you going to protect these people? Mr. Sanders. Neil, you have a big job on your hands. Fred, I'm sure you've done a great job. I don't know much about you. But I do know that this was a huge, huge tragedy. And you guys have done nothing to make it better. I see the report. I've got the report. I know what it says. I've read through it. What about the, uh, why would you extend TriMet service to new areas when safety isn't even up to par in your existing services? You want to extend all this and, and have no safety program in place for your existing problems. You've got a big job to do, Neil. You know, you need to come out of that office and ride these buses. These people need to know the drivers have got to be more aware of, and, and they have been since this accident and my daughter's life has been taken. They have been more aware of this safety. It's understandable. But too little too late. 32 people have died since 1988. Two other people died on top of the two people that were killed in my daughter's accident. They, were, they died on a rail line accident the same night. Four people in one night. We've got drivers. I, my sister calls me from Beaverton. A driver runs through a light to try to beat an eight-year-old kid across the street in a crosswalk. The bus 76, and I have all the details. It's ridiculous. You guys need to do something about this. You need to have more awareness to these. You, you're, you've got a position open for a safety advisor or a safety coordinator. Mr. Lairbox, the only one who's brought up anything about safety in both the meetings I've attended. And Fred, you had to. I was here the last time. We need to do some more things about it. We need more ride arounds with these drivers. We need drivers that are less aggressive. We need drivers that don't think that they own the road. They serve the public. The public is the boss. They're not. You're not, for crying out loud. The public is. Amen. And you're killing them. It's evident. There's proof right there. Let's see some safety, guys. <laughs>